So Zoom has just released a firmware 3.0 version uh, for the Zoom F4. Now this is a pretty big deal because the biggest uh, con for buying this mixer was that the headphone um, preamp was just really low. Like, you know, it was kind of a deal breaker, um, you know, for a lot of people. I don't do sound that much, I'm a DP, um, but like I still do the one man band thing. So I hadn't used it for a while and I used it the other day and had to record sound and it really made me want to get a sound devices uh, recorder because the sound was just so low and I hadn't used it for a while. So my impression of it was that uh, it was definitely an issue. So I just got an email, they said they had a firmware update. Um, wasn't really too interested, but something told me to look and in it, it said that it actually boosts the, I guess a digital boost to the headphone um, output. So I figured I'd load it up and see uh, how much of a difference it makes. And I have to say, it makes a huge difference. It's almost like makes the fact that this was, uh, that that feature of it, that con, that uh, that defect, you know, was, a, um, you know, how was, how was the deal breaker? It actually like, kind of undid it. Um, so first I'll show you how to kind of like just the difference in it. Uh, the, the, the interface looks a little different, uh, but it's pretty much the same. And, uh, but what you'll see that's different is if you go to output, and you, you go all the way down to the bottom, I'm already there, but if you go all the way down to the bottom, you have this new option that says HP, which is headphone uh, digital boost. And then you can go in there and then choose how much you want to boost it. So I figured I'd boost it up all the way and I can just turn it, uh, turn down the uh, the original knob, uh, I'd exchange my, you know, adjust my exposure. But I would just turn out the original, you know, the knob, the physical knob, you know, and make the adjustments. But uh, as I'm sure you're wondering, you know, with all of this talking, right? Like, how good does it work? So what I'll do is I'll turn all the way up. I have the digital boost, the headphone gain uh, boost up to, let me go back to output. I have it up to 24, which is the max. Now I recorded, uh, what I'm about to play, I recorded it from, um, from actually the, uh, from, from the, uh, the XY adapter or whatever this thing is called, but the, I forget the exact name of it, but I recorded um, into this from my sound device, it's just mic pre. Uh, so I forget it was like the MP1 or something because I wanted to bypass the um, bypass the preamps. And so I have just a set of headphones here. It's on my desk and um, I'm gonna play it. And I think that you will, like me, you will find that it's a significant uh, increase in sound volume. So this is everything all the way up and listen. Um, uh, they say, So now, if anybody knows and is familiar with this Zoom L4, uh, you know, even though this isn't a scientific test, but to be able to just hear audio coming from here at this level, now look at the level of it. So it's not like it's, it was recorded super loud, but um, so to hear it coming from headphones uh, this loud, you know, is definitely an improvement to say the least. So yeah, kudos to Zoom. You know, you guys After definitely uh, made an effort to improve it, and this is definitely an improvement. She's in charge of the whole Cuba all right, see you guys next time.